And today we are featuring the big brother of the year, Bill Blakemore, with his little Caden. Hi, guys. Good afternoon again. Good, afternoon. Yeah. Good to see you guys. Yeah. And uh, Bill, congratulations. Well, thank you. As I mentioned when I got it, I couldn't do it without him. But <laughs> yeah. yeah, I <laughs> but guess uh, you share in the award case because, because yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I get the little plaque, but he, it's because of him. Well, <laughs> you might not get a plaque, but you get um, how many years now of this uh, partnership? We're finishing up eight. Eight? Wow. I actually remember when Bill first brought you here, Caden, you were a quiet, little, shy kid. And, uh, you know, and I looked at the two of you and I thought, uh, I, I don't know, this doesn't seem like a match, but <laughs> <laughs> it obviously is. Yep. Cool. He, he, he asked me once, um, you were 13 and we had one of his buddies in the car and he said, why do you put up with us teenagers? <laughs> <laughs> and I forget my answer, but uh, yeah, so now it's still five years later and we're still together. That's great. Caden, uh, were there days where you thought, uh, I don't know, I guess I don't need a big brother anymore? Probably when it was like first starting, like, I, like when I was like first couple of years in like the program, I was like, you know, maybe I don't need this anymore, but like it's, it's still nice to like have the help and be able to receive it if I absolutely need like help like with a subject. Do you feel like you have to put something into it too? <sighs> Patience. <laughs> <laughs> so you're now 16, going on 17. Yep. In a month. In July, yeah. Yeah. And you're a uh, sophomore at Vandercook. Nice. So over the years, you've changed probably the kinds of things you like to do. Uh, Bill used to like to take you out uh, to junkyard dog for hot dogs. Do you still like to do that? Uh, yeah, we still go there pretty frequently. Yeah. What are some? What are the? I guess some of the guy things you do. Well, I guess go ahead. Recently, we went and we were like uh, doing gardening, which I mean not very guy like, I guess. But we we do gardening. We. Just hang out, we talk a lot. Um, sometimes we go grab a couple of drinks and hang out, make him try some new things, he makes me try new things. Um, every once in a while, we'll, like, uh, I think, we haven't done it in a while, but we used to go uh, hang out and throw a ball back and forth. You actually, uh, you, t you two sound a lot alike. <laughs> <laughs> you picked up e either each other's uh, speech patterns or mannerisms, you, you do, if I call your house, you answer the phone, you wouldn't know. Hmm. Well, I, I can remember when people would say that about me and my dad, you know, and it used to just drive me insane. <laughs> <laughs> but later I, I was appreciated it, so maybe one of these days he'll appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, well, I think you picked up a little of that Texas draw. <laughs> Bill, that, in addition to, you know, Caden, um, having him put effort into it, it's, it's been an for you, that's that's a lot. Eight years. Uh, yeah, we've we've been um, every Wednesday, and we do we do things that are. Uh, when I say we do things, we're together every week, mm -hmm. every Wednesday at two o'clock. Since he was in the third grade, mm -hmm. we've been together, and uh, unless I'm on vacation or he's on vacation, um, and. That's a kind of above and beyond what Big Brothers really suggest. But uh, at first it was just an hour a day, you know, an hour a Wednesday. But now it, it might, generally it's two hours on Wednesday, uh, every Wednesday. And sometimes it's three, um, depends on <laughs> where we are or what we're doing. Yeah. Um, but it's it's been interesting. I've had people say, or ask me, you know, like he asked me, why do you do this? <laughs> you know? And um, it's, it's just the part of being able to give back, put into somebody's life, and hopefully somewhere along the line it, it'll show up. I, I will, uh, he texted me, it was last January, I think, I was visiting my daughter in Florida and I got this text, and it was, uh, he told me some stuff, and then he said, 
see, I do listen to some of the things you tell me. <laughs> so I thought, okay, you know, a few years, this things rub off. So, okay, for you to say, you know, why you do this, uh, what you know, it's, it recognizes that you you're putting something into it. It's 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 a commitment. Mm -hmm. So, you, do you look forward to? Yeah, every well, week I look forward yeah. to it. Honestly, I, I enjoy our time together, and when we do get to spend like the extended period of time, like you said, sometimes three hours, I normally have fun. We get to go see things that I normally don't see, so mm -hmm. I enjoy it. He, he makes the, uh, the adventure kind of fun sometimes. Other times, it drives me off the wall. <laughs> 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 so you feel like you've uh, grown. There's been you know you know aspects of your life that you might not have uh, been exposed to without Bill. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Like. Uh, like uh, what we're doing right now, I probably would have never met you or been on the show ever. That's and right. There's a lot of people I've met through uh, Bill, and I'm happy to have met them people. Just met two more out front before yeah. we came in. Uh, mm -hmm. Steve Shotwell and Gary Schwartz. Short Schwartzling. Gary, yeah. <laughs> 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 I always get his last name messed up. Sorry, Gary. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so just trying to, uh, as I tell him, expose him to some of my friends and help with that social interaction. and. Mm -hmm. Uh, meeting other people. Yeah, because uh, when I first met you, I thought you were pretty shy. I definitely was. Yeah, but you, not not now. I, you've, uh, you've changed. I'm a little less shy, yeah, but like, I, I he'd probably tell you better. Like, it, when he introduces me, he'll do a lot of talking. I'll shake their hand, and I normally hang back. It's mostly just on my part. But I do I do talk to a lot of people when we do meet people. Yeah, Bill's not shy. <laughs> and the thing, he just made the comment, he shakes your hand. When we first met, you know, that was not in his, um, I won't say vocabulary, but that's not, it wasn't in his comfort zone. Uh, yeah, well, wheelhouse, as you, you came said. in today, you shook my hand. Yeah. yeah, but I said, you know, we went through that and, and learned. And so he may not say a lot when I, like with Mr. Shotwell and Gary, uh, you know, that hand went right out there. And so, well, yeah, you know, I'm proud of him. It's one of those soft skills that, uh, you know, Bill, former uh, small business uh, man and employer, you, you are cognizant of the kinds of soft skills someone needs to make it in the world. Mm -hmm. So you're sharing some of that with, with Caden. Trying. Yeah. What are you involved in at uh, Vandercook? Nothing right now. Yeah. Um, there was a point where I was going to try baseball. That didn't go too well. <laughs> I missed the first practice. But next year I plan to get involved in the Career yeah. Center. What are you going to do this summer? Uh, I'm hoping that I can get a job this summer. That's my hope. And maybe driver's ed. Nice. Dr you're not driving yet? No. Um, the way uh, my family looks at it is I should focus on schoolwork a lot more than I should anything uh -huh. else, really. Well, there you go. <laughs> Do what they say. But when time comes, I'm, I'm sure Bill will help you. Hopefully. Yeah. Another thing. Yeah, as he gets older, there's new, new adventures because of his age. Yep. Yeah, yeah I just don't know. If I'll ever let him drive my car just yet. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be well, like that when I with my son, you know, and daughter. <laughs> oh, that first time, you know, but but uh, he'll get there. Yeah. Well, we uh, it's it's been fun watching uh, you guys uh, over the years, and thanks for being our uh, Big Brothers uh, match of the month. You're very welcome. Glad to be here again. It was fun. Yeah. yeah. Congratulations, uh, match, uh, for being the Big Brother of the Year. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank uh, with uh, Match of the Month, Caden and his big brother, Bill Blakemore. Summer at Clark Lake. Wow. Uh, if it wasn't fun enough, the events make it even more fun. And to tell us about what's planned this summer, Jenna Shemluski is with us. And she uh, has triathlons and uh, pontoon boat uh, activities and so much more. Details next.